In order to see the effect of tillage on a diversified organic vegetable farm in Dane County, Wisconsin, we simulated rainfall on four soil samples. The first sample was tilled and seeded to a rye and veg cover crop 10 months ago, and then tilled two weeks ago to kill the cover. The second sample is the same as the first, except that the cover crop is being killed with a tarp instead of tillage. The third sample was last tilled 22 months ago when it was seeded to sorghum Sudan grass. Tomatoes were planted into the winter killed residue the following season and mulched with marsh hay. The fourth sample is from the field edge and has never been tilled. An equal volume of water was added to each sample. As the water filters through the holes in the top container, it rains down on the soil sample below. The first sample with the most recent tillage is on the left, the fourth sample with no tillage is on the right. As the water hits the soil, it will either run off and be collected in the container in front of the sample, infiltrate the soil and be collected in the container under the sample, or be absorbed by the soil. All these samples were collected the day after a rain that brought soil moisture to field capacity. As the simulation runs, it is easy to see that the most recently tilled soil has the most runoff and that the collected water is cloudy with small soil particles leaving the sample as erosion. The second sample has less runoff and the soil particles are larger and settle quickly to the bottom of the container. The third sample has much less runoff and what little it does have is completely clear and free of soil. The fourth sample has virtually no runoff at all. This chart shows the volume of water collected from each sample through each pathway. The second sample absorbed more water than the other three, likely because the tarp covering kept that soil a bit drier. While the amount of runoff from the first sample is certainly notable, it is also notable how similar the third and fourth samples are. These results seem to indicate that if we can avoid tillage for even two years, we can dramatically improve water infiltration and reduce erosion.